This insane power of the B-2 stealth bomber jet will blow your mind. The B-2 stealth bomber does not need any introduction when it comes to the most powerful bombers that exist today. It has a defined pedigree and an insane arsenal to boot, which is still enough to send a terror down enemy forces' spines. We will talk more about the history and the awesome power of the B-2 stealth bomber in just a minute. First, I would like to request that you subscribe to the channel. Subscription is a brilliant way of supporting the channel, and I will really appreciate all the help that you can send our way. A big thank you in advance for that. So, the B-2 stealth bomber was manufactured by the Northrop Grumman Corporation. It was designed to carry a payload of 40,000 pounds and was powered by four General Electric F-118 GE-100 engines. These beasts are able to repel the B-2 at high subsonic speeds and give it an intercontinental range of operation. The stealth bomber can operate at a ceiling of about 15,000 meters and can carry traditional or nuclear armaments. The B-2 stealth bomber was created in the Cold War as a strategic stealth bomber. The initial design of the bomber was inspired by the designs of Jack Northrup, who was known to be one of the brightest aeronautical engineers at the time. He was the first engineer to design the flying wing, which could have been adopted as early as the 1950s, but it did not gain much acceptance back then. The B-2 Spirit, as it was originally called, was a multi-role bomber which could carry both traditional and nuclear munitions. It made sense to have such a strategic aircraft in the arsenal because the world was split between the communist bloc and the free world back then. The B-2 aircraft made huge strides towards the bomber modernization program in the US and was the first of its kind. The B-2 stealth bomber was a necessity of its time since it was vital in transporting nuclear warheads and checkmating the Soviets in the global chess of geopolitics. It was the best bet of the West in moving past impenetrable defenses through sheer firepower. The B-2 stealth bomber is unique in the sense that it provided flexibility and operability as well as sheer firepower to crush through enemies' air defenses. One of the key characteristics, as you might have guessed, was its lower radar detection. It was feared because it could get past the enemy's most sophisticated defenses and destroy key enemy infrastructure. The B-52 was an exceptionally strong conventional and nuclear deterrent, which continues to be useful even in today's warfare. One of the more novel features of the B-2 stealth bomber was to integrate stealth capability with increasingly high aerodynamic design. Coupled with the capacity to carry a payload of about 20 tons, it was a monster of a bomber with an equally impressive freedom of action as well as range and field of view. The aircraft design has an excellent range of about 10,000 kilometers, which makes it an intercontinental strategic bomber. But how does the B-2 stealth bomber become invisible to radar? The stealth capability of the B-2 is based on a range of reduced infrared, acoustic, electromagnetic, visual, and radar systems. With the combined effect of all these systems, the B-2 stealth bomber becomes a challenge for the cutting-edge avionics and radar detection systems of today. Since the B-2 is still used in the theater of war, much about how the bomber actually gains its stealth capability remains classified. However, we do know that the B-2 is made up of specific composite materials, special coating, and the unique flying design of the wings. The B-2 stealth bomber is manned by a crew of two pilots, one of which sits on the left seat and the mission commander sits on the right. As compared to the B-52, which has five crew members, the B-2 only has two. The stealth bomber was first exposed to the public in 1988 when it was rolled out of its hangar. The B-2 only has an operational base at Whiteman AFB, Missouri. The B-2 stealth bomber proved its worth in Operation Allied Force as it was deployed against Serbian targets. The B-2 bomber was so devastating that it wiped out 33% of Serbian military infrastructure in the first eight weeks. In those bombing runs, it flew from its base in Missouri to Kosovo. It is alleged that the B-2 was also responsible for dropping bombs on the Chinese embassy in Sarajevo. It was also used very effectively in the operation Enduring Freedom. The B-2 flew all the way to Afghanistan from Whiteman, the B-2 completed its first ever deployment in Operation Iraqi Freedom. 
During all this campaign, the B-2 released almost 2 million pounds of munitions on the enemy. So, what makes the B-2 such a fascinating aircraft? All of its spare parts and materials are made from the ground up. The B-2 is the most resilient aircraft in the world, which combines long range with stealth capability and powerful munitions. It also has the record of launching the longest aerial mission in history, which was during its campaign in Afghanistan, with a mission totaling 44 hours. If that was not enough, the strategic bomber has also made guest appearances in movies such as Independence Day, Armageddon, Cloverfield, and most recently in Captain Marvel. I hope you found this video informative. Please press the like button if you did. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching the video till the end and see you in the next one.